Isa sa mga kinatatakutang boksingero noon ay ang axman ng Jamaica na si Nicholas Walters. Sino man ang magtangkang humamon sa kanya ay nagiging biktima ng kanyang malapalakol na kamao tulad na nangyari kina Victor Chinyan at sa ating kababayan si Nonito Donaire Jr. Ngunit nang makalaban na ni Nicholas Walters ang high-tech boxer mula sa bansang Ukraine na si Vasil Lomachenko, hindi niya nagamit ang kanyang sandata. Ano ang nag-udyo kay Axman para sumuko na lang sa laban? At bakit hindi na natin muling nakita ang anino ni Nicholas Walters sa ibabaw ng ring? Yan ang ating tatalakayin sa video ito mga pare ko pero kung bago ka palang sa Sports Manda, i-click mo ng subscribe button at ang notification bell para updated ka sa mga bagong uploads ng inyong lingkod. Mula nang sumampa si Axman Nicholas Walter sa professional boxing noong 2008, kinarabas niya ang kanyang mga nakakalaban at umiskor ng 26 na sunod-sunod na panalo na may nakakagimbal na 77.7% knockout win ratio. Kasama sa mga prominenteng kalaban na kanyang binigo sa featherweight division ay sina Victor Chinyan, Nonito Donaire Jr. at Miguel Mariaga. At nang umakyat sa super featherweight, nakatapat ni Walter si Jason Sosa na kung saan ang laban ay nauwi sa majority draw na sa palagay ni Axman eh, siya ang dapat na nanalo. Ilang buwan matapos ang laban kay Sosa, umugong noon ang negosasyon sa pagtatapat ni na Walters at Lumachenko. May mga drama pang ang nangyari dahil hiniling ng kampo ni Walters ang isang milyong dolyar na kikitain versus Lumachenko kaso hindi pumayag ang top rank na nag-counter offer lang ng $550,000. Hindi ito nagustuhan ni Walters at nangatwirang wala na silang maiuuwi dahil sa tax pa lang eh, malaki na ang mababawa sa kanyang kita kaya tinanggihan nila ang laban. Makaraan ng mahigit isang taon ng walang aksyon, napilitan si Nicholas Walters na lunukin ang kanyang pride at tanggapin ang offer ng top rank kaya natuloy ang digmaan sa pagitan ni Navasi Lumachenko at Nicholas Walters. Sa mga pre-fight interview nga eh, nagbitiw agad ng prediksyon itong si Axman na pababagsakin niya daw si Loma. We take in every round, we fight in every round intelligently, we fight in every round with style and techniques and we definitely plan to take him out. You think you're going to win? Of course I think I'm going to win. But yeah. how do you think? Why knock out? You think you're going to knock him out? Yeah, I think so. Tail of the tape tayo mga pare koys. Si Nicholas Walters ay may undefeated record na 26 wins with 21 knockouts at may isang draw. Samantalang ang nooy WBO Super Featherweight Champ na si Vasil Lomachenko ay may numerong 6 wins with 4 knockouts at isang talo. Tara mga pare koys, balikan natin ang laban nila Lomachenko at Walters noong November 26, 2016 sa Cosmopolitan of Las Vegas in Las Vegas, Nevada. Jim. 
And in addition to that, smart to try to land that straight right hand to the body side. Good quick left hand, who's not as talented as he is, but but he is supremely talented. And when Lomachenko's going low, making him get used to seeing it, but not throwing it off of it. Eventually, Focusing much on Lomachenko's body. Because again, that was a good shot. To have any chance against Vasily Lomachenko. You might want to focus on the body for the first stages of the fight. So in this round, Walt finally throws body shots. Still missing with the right hand upstairs. Nicholas Walters, he's a step-around fighter of the highest order. Yeah, the other thing... Small or the light offense. Then once he gets settled at home, he brings a bomb. Lomachenko that... Yeah, now that, and also usually a sign that a lot of people in the corner feel they need to give you advice because you're not doing well. Harold, how do you have it through? When Lomachenko throws that right jab, he covers up. If I were Nicholas, Walt is covering up too much. Three to nothing, Lomachenko. A couple things about that. Harold brings up some interesting points. One, Lomachenko established Walters should punch more because his best chance is to catch Lomachenko in an exchange. He's a boxer puncher. He just went at it with a good hook, and Lomachenko countered the hook with two big punches, so... They say, well, Walters should throw more. But if Walters throw... <laughs> good body shot by Lomachenko. Here on the defensive. Even when he's not trying... And that's something hard. Put a hook by, him on, good hook him by the x man Stop, 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 stop! Greg, he so easily established his position stop, with stop, his foot. Gets inside of Nicholas Walters' long arms. Find Lomachenko landing 55 out of 234, Walters 26 out of 153. But if you're searching for the right voice in the corner, it's what he did to Gary Russell Jr. <laughs> Gary Russell Jr. is a special talent. Shut him out. And, and Nicholas Walt fans want to see and think very highly of on the kind of outskirts. Oh, with him, he move, moves around him like that to a, a point to where Nicholas he is less likely to throw punches because he doesn't see anything. And, and for a good, he has such mastery over distance that I don't see a lot of opportunity. Walt is looking for an opening instead of just punching until he finds an opening. With Lomachenko, he punches until he finds an opening. The Axe Man. It's amazing to watch what this man can do. So you know Max. Because he's a southpaw and because he's demonstrably a great defender, I've recently heard people busy an offensive fighter and not nearly as uh, dynamic an offensive fighter. But Purnell's defense is the reason that in his pro I mean, no one. I'm wondering, based on what I've seen in the last couple of rounds, Roy, if Nicholas Walters is starting to think he's got a better chance of left, left as he's stepping to my left side. Maybe I can run him into it. But that's what. Dangerous is right now. Good body. Left talk to the body. That's a good, a good choice and a weapon that could help him down. Some combinations upstairs um, against the response. And just then he cashed in on it. Good body shot by Nicholas. Yeah, he's landed some big Way too slick for that. Nope. Yeah. almost landed an uppercut, and now. If this was a huge kind of pay-per-view extravaganza, stop, stop, up, up. what Lomachenko is doing would be highlighted by the fact that he's doing each one of the first six rounds of the fight. So we're halfway through. The skill Lomachenko was Pep as aggressive and varied an oh, offensive oh, fighter oh, as he oh, is. No. Right-handed. Well, there's more. Right. Really, Pep couldn't crack, and Lomachenko but can punch. It wasn't a big puncher, but a beautiful boxer. Yes, he had done. There's nothing that they're telling him. Well, and our our great. Spanish interpreter Jerry Olaya has the weekend off. Good body shot. That there's a mixed message. Oh, good shot. Well, because he knows how it feels, and now he's pressing his attack, trying to get him out. Who can punch like Walters? Walters badly off balance. Good hook by Walters. Gets in a good left hook. Just a straight right hand away. Like that right there. Oh my God! I mean, he's toying with oh, Nicholas is Walters. This is amazing. What, what's going to be really funny is the next time. Because this is indeed becoming toyage. I told you that three rounds ago. Yeah, you did. <laughs> you were right. No, my, no, my, no, my. Yeah, yeah. One, one, two, no. Okay. 
You're stopping the fight. That's astonishing. Apparently making a decision that there just wasn't any way. It wasn't. They're the winner by TKO victory, Asil Matapos malasap ang matinding boxing lesson sa kamay ni Vasil Lomachenko, sinabi ni Walters na kaya daw siya natalo ay dahil sa nabakanti siya ng matagal na panahon. Bukod pa dito, nabanggit din ni Walters na tinamaan siya ng magagandang kombinasyon mula kay Loma kaya nagdesisyon ng kanyang kampo na sumuko na lang sa laban. Mga parikoys, ito na ang huling duelo ni Axman sa ibabaw ng lona. Nabalita nga noon na magbabalik sana siya sa boxing ring kaso biglang nagkaroon ng pandemya. Sa kasalukuyan, naninirahan si Nicholas Walters sa Panama at mukhang wala na atang planong bumalik sa pagboboxing. Wala na din akong makita o mabasang balita tungkol sa kanya at may mga ekspertong nagsasabi na ang naging dahilan ng kanyang pagbagsak ay ang pagkagat ni Walters sa kamay ng mga taong nagpapakain sa kanya. Bueno, ito lamang po ang hatid ng Sportsmanda sa inyo. Maraming salamat at God bless!